Okay, he's not even sure what's going on. At 3325, he says maybe it's a midlife crisis for her. But he also mentions, and I agree with this, um, cosmetically, they can make her look much younger. And I saw the photos that she posted on Instagram. She's 36 years old, and she's getting 1,880 people to pay $25 a month to see her naked. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's $47,000 a month. Um whether it's through filters, whether maybe she, she does have a lot of makeup and I'm not putting her down at all. She's been able to parlay her uh, physical appearance with the augmentation of either cosmetic surgery or, uh, or cosmetics to look good enough to have this audience. Um, yeah. But maybe he knows something we don't know. Uh, I, he probably does. He's seen her coming out of the shower. Or he has seen her. Uh, well, there's lots of pictures on her Instagram, which we'll unpack in a moment, that are that are blurred out at the right areas where you can see her coming out of the shower and breastfeeding one kid while doing the other one's hair, and the other one takes a picture for her, right? For her, for the gram. So you know, we'll we'll watch that train wreck in a minute. Yeah, I mean, so, but to her credit. Look at the Playboy models, you know, throughout the decades, they are airbrushed and they're made up perfectly, the hair, the skin. They're always touch up, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. and with today's technology, it's probably mm -hmm. not that hard to do. Um, at 36.50, as a timestamp in Rolo's interview, uh, you know, he talks about her life coach journey started two or three years ago. So she's finding herself, and now she's putting herself in a position I don't even know what the credentials are, to be honest, about being there a are life no, you coach. Have to have, you have to have blue blocking sunglasses, and that's about it. Okay. Yeah. But she was a bartender before. Yes. And she made, she was a seamstress for kids' clothes. And uh, she was a teacher. She was a stay at home mom, then hit life coach. Uh, so I think what she's doing is parlaying her fame, if you want to call it fame, into trying to tell other people, hey, I discovered myself. Now, I'm not putting her down, but this is how things are starting to crystallize of what's going on here. Um, one thing that the husband mentioned is that she has off the charts interpersonal skills, and that could be true. She could be great interpersonally with people, and she appears that way. Now she just has parlayed that into um, monetizing it for a monthly subscription fee to show her body. Uh, I don't know everything that goes on in her channel, in her fans only channel, but she's probably completely naked. Uh, but I don't know what level of sexuality there is or how, if there's any censoring or what she does. But if she's just walking around in sexy lingerie or nude, uh, there is a demand for that. And well, we've, well, we've come to the realization today that simps and their money are easily parted with OnlyFans. <laughs> and it doesn't even have to be a hot 20-year-old, a mommy of three in her 30s with some decent airbrushing and a professional photographer you can land the job too.